hungry. Shh. Told to wait, you wait. She'll show up. Eventually. Hey, any word from Sarah about babysitting tomorrow? Not yet. <sighs> but it's only... 10.30. Hey, you know, I bet old Mrs. Pruitt would love to come. She babysat you when you were a baby, you remember? Wasn't she the one with the eye patch? Yeah. Yeah, I think her parrot kept attacking me. So you do remember. Okay, keep trying, Sarah. Okay. Does that screech mean Sarah's back? Or did something vampire and bad just happen? Or both? I read online Dirk Battison is making an appearance right here. Dirk Battison from Dusk. Can you believe it? I'm pretty sure that's just a rumor. How would you know? Because I started it. I, I thought it might lure Sarah back. I, I needed to know she's okay. It's, it's my fault that she drank human blood. Just don't be mad. I don't get mad. I get hungry. You gonna invite me in? See you too. But what happened? Did you find Jesse and make him pay for turning you to a vampire? And I'm fine. Okay. I have some new challenges, but I've accepted it. So let's just move on, okay? I'm so excited to get back to school, aren't you? Yeah, but you don't have to accept it. I'm still looking for a vampire cure to get you back to normal. This is Whitechapel. Vampires are normal here. Fine. Just what matters is that you're back. For good? I should let you get some sleep. It is really good to be back. Of course I'm glad she's back, but... I don't know, she seemed... different, and... <laughs> okay, come on, cut it out. I was just testing something. Now, I was trying to summon chicks, and then... Aww. Well... Well, just focus for now on Benny. I'm worried about her. Look, Sarah's probably just traumatized. She'll need time to adjust. And <laughs> then... then the fledgling says, my dentist is the one with the cavities now. <laughs> Adjustment complete. Trauma all gone. Vampires happy, happy. Look who I bumped into. Care for a welcome back check? Oh, Benny's so cute. That'll be a yummy snack later. What? It's a joke, Ethan. I don't remember you being so serious. I don't remember you being so funny. But good one. <laughs> That's us. Even immortals still have to go to class. Uh, Bye. You know, I'm not usually a fan of full blast undead bloodsuckers, but she makes it look good. Oh, almost forgot. Now that you're back, I'm supposed to give you this. It's from the council. The council? The vampire council. After Jesse left, the V's are less wild, more structured. Kind of lame. But the parties are totally worth it. Especially the snacks. Initiation? Mm -hmm. Orientation? Mm -hmm. I'm not joining any fang club. Stop right there, young lady. Excuse me? Who are you? Your new vice principal, Mr. Stern. You may call me sir. And you are a young missy who doesn't think twice about littering our hallways. Okay. I'll think twice about it. 
There. Are we done? Good. Not so fast. Not until you make a deposit in the nearest trash can. Whatever you say. No. Get me out of here! No! <laughs> and what happened? I got angry? And then I couldn't stop it! Duh! Vampire urges are so much stronger than fledgling urges. Don't worry. I think I got this. Trick. Well, I, um, uh, Oblivio Memnath, Obliviar to Kaput. I, you. What are you kids staring at? Just get back to class. Now. <laughs> Going somewhere, little one. Now is not. A good time, unless you'd enjoy watching your arms grow back. <laughs> See, this is the problem. Vampire on vampire attacks. Two more just last night, same night you came back to town. Your brothers and sisters on the council are concerned. What? Just because we have the same teeth, we're family? No thanks. Fine. Maybe the one we want is your little vampire hunter boyfriend. <laughs> Leave him alone. Leave me alone, unless you want to see some vampire on vampire attack right now. He's not my boyfriend. Forget it. Let's go after the geek. The brainy one, not the magic one. Good. The magic one creeps me out. I know how she feels. When I first got my powers, I totally couldn't deal. I got so mad once, I wanted to fight the moon. <laughs> but I didn't. The moon's safe for now. Just, can we change the subject? I've had enough vampire drama for one day. <laughs> oh, thanks, I like Wow! It. The rumor was true! It's Dirk Battison from Dusk. I can't believe he's here. I can't believe anyone cares. Dude, I heart blood sparkle and feel sad a lot. Blame. A picture of both hey, of you, sure. Dirk. Ethan Morgan here, school newspaper. Surprised you're here. <laughs> yeah, me too. I didn't even know about this till I saw it on the net. My agent stopped calling me after Dusk 4, the 3D musical went psh, psh. Well, this is Whitechapel. Vampires will always be kind of big here. Some hopes. Oh, thank you. You were trying to keep us apart. Well, tap buttons, because Dirk is going to spend some quality time with his number one fan. Okay. But after the signing, I have a duty to my fans. Dusk 2, scene 28. We're vampires. We take what we want. Remember? <laughs> oh. ah. oh. Who is your personal hey. trainer? Back off! He's mine! Okay, lamos. Who wants authentic guy from Dust Coffee Cup? And he's time to 100! Where's your limo? Limo? I drove my mom's hatchbacks parked across the street. Listen to me, Dirk. Your desk adventure is about to get real. Oh, you're one of those. Well, look, I can't bite you. I did that once and I got sued. And I got gum disease. <gasps> Sarah? I think Eric is a little out of control. I'm sure she's fine, but you need to watch your back. I think some angry vampires are looking for you. <sighs> me? No. The Duskers are mad at Eric for stealing Dirk. I'm surprised he even showed up. <laughs> Uh, here we go. Dirk? Hey! Ethan? I know you guys are sad about Dirk Ethan? leaving, but you don't have to get rough. Things are about to get a whole lot rougher, little hunter. <laughs> Whoa! You're real? Look, I'm no hunter, but some of my best friends are vampires. Erica? Rory? Wait, Rory's your, your friend? And you admit it? <laughs> Dude, that's just messed up! <laughs> Come on. The council knows you're in on the recent attacks, and they want to see you suffer. In person. Uh, stand back. I don't hunt vampires, but I have staked in self-defense. Oh, yeah. This is a number two pencil. Yeah, two. You know what that's for? Or should I draw you a picture, huh? Huh? There's something behind me, isn't there? Well, 
Looks like I'm not the only one with anger issues. Yeah, I didn't do anything. Why are they so steamed at Ethan? They think he's after them. First, two vamps were attacked in his backyard. Then, two more tried to pick him up and they were taken out too. I'm really worried about him. Me too. I promised them I'd hand Ethan over so they wouldn't end me. But he didn't do anything! He said they were attacked by a smelly green mist. Smelly green mist? Did Ethan's mom make tacos again? By the way, is he here? The, the council wants us to bring him to justice, wherever that is. It's true. There was a green mist. I saw it. That's Ethan, but I don't see him. I'm right here. Whoa, oh, do you know what this means? I've perfected the invisibility spell without even trying. <laughs> or he's in that locker. Ow! Yes, Benny, I'm in the locker. If the vamps come for me here at school, at least I've got backup. Oh, you can count on me! Ow! After I bring you to justice, do you know if that's around here? I can't help you, Rory. I need time to prove I'm innocent. But the halls are full of fangs. Those aren't real vamps. It's Dusk Day at WC High. In honor of Erica's new pet movie star. Gotta go. Just sit tight and don't let the vampires bite. Same to you. Remember, bite your tongue, not their face. Okay, so, Walker boy, I get beat up all day because they blame you, and you blame a green mist, and I bet the mist blames the unicorns, and... The mist was real, Benny. Almost alive. And it had a smell. It smelled like... evil. Evil? Okay, and I'm intrigued. I wonder if any of these smell familiar. Here, try this one. Oh, it smells like bacon and gym socks. Impressive. Um, here, try this. Ew. Wow. Wait. It's pretty close. What is it? Ha! Sulfur. Or to the necromancer, brimstone. And where there's brimstone, there's black magic. Or rotten eggs. There were no eggs. Black magic it is! This mist is about to get demystified. Can I get a high five? Whoa! Ugh. Dude, did you spill some of that on your hand? No, I scratched my butt. Ugh. Ugh. Ethan! Ethan! Uh, nope. Guess he's not home. Ethan, where are you? Oh, great. I'll be right over. No, don't worry. I won't tell any vampires you're hiding at the library. Fan code zero. I repeat, fan code zero. Ow! Ow! Ow. Why in the head? Sorry, man. Should have put a this end up stamp on this blanket. Yeah. Okay. All clear. I doubled back and snuck in, and I marked every spell that involves evil smoke, sulfur, and violence. Wow, that's a lot of smoky violence. Hence the name Black Magic and not Nice Sunny Smiley Face Magic. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's over a dozen disappearances in the last month, and on almost all of them, they say no recent picture available. So this magic mist attacked people who don't own a camera. Or a mist that attacks people who don't show up on camera. Right, shy people. No, dude, vampires. Here, 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 this must be it. Inspira Mortis, the breath of death. Whoever uses this can transform their anger or dark energies into a physical vapor that seeks out and destroys its intended target. That's why it totally ignored me. It's only going after vampires. We have to warn Sarah. Hi, this is Sarah. Come on, Please Sarah. Where week. are you? somewhere half pint let me through i have to talk to the council about these vampire attacks before it's too late i swear i'm not trying to hurt anyone too bad because i am i think i found a way to fight the breath of death oh, 
And don't say hold your noses. Ancient tribes use these wish bottles to lure evil spirits away from people and then trap them. Cool. Last time I checked, we're fresh out of witch bottles. Any container can work. Like this. As long as you put the right symbols on them and I say the right spell over it. The hard part's the bait. Bait? Items from the spirit's target. Well, this mist is targeting vampires, so we put vampire stuff in the jar? What vampire stuff? Not my internal organs. No. I need those. Have you gone number one recently? Ew! <laughs> Sarah's not answering. Sarah? Not quite, but I know where she is, and it's not good. The council put her on trial. Two goons just showed up to drag me to the hearing. A trial? No, this is bad. They're all in danger. Where is it? The old Mason Lodge. I'd hurry if I were you. Do we have to go? You know, there's more to me than vampires. I played Hamlet and Shakespeare for dogs. Ew. Might want to take that off your resume. Okay, okay, we're going. Just don't get your fangs in a twist. You show no allegiance to your kind. You forfeit your rights and protections by willfully conspiring. Who cares who I conspire with? My friends aren't your problem. You're the ones who need their protection. Give her a break. So she doesn't come to meetings. She's never been much of a joiner. She even quit the Dust fan club and I was president. Your best friend did that? No way. Sorry, sweetie, but it's true. Now pipe down before you get eaten. Sarah's always done her own thing. Sometimes she's not even any fun. She's my friend. She's one of us now. And she's no threat to us. You may not be a threat, but your little stake-wielding friends are. Deliver them to us as a sign of loyalty. Or, if you'd rather side with them, you can accept our punishment on their behalf. But we will have blood. Yours or theirs. So come and get it, Princess, because I've been itching for a fight all day. Let her go! I'm the one you want. I've got this! Why are you here? Trying to protect you. Well, I was trying to protect you. Well, we're protecting you, too. Look, I didn't touch your friends. They were attacked by a spell called the Breath of Death. Yeah, pretty scary, right? But what matters is we can stop it. True. They made me go in a jar. Quiet. Perhaps we owe these boys a chance to prove their innocence. That's very reasonable. Thank you. I move the mortals be devoured now. What? You can't do that. Stop. No That's way. Totally How does that let us prove our innocence at all? If the attacks continue after you're gone, then I guess you are innocent. Seems fair enough. Oh, I totally disagree with that assessment! I guess I got my orientation after all. You taught me when to control myself, and when not to. Sarah, wait! You call yourself a council? Don't you even have to take a vote? Fine. All in favor? Show of hands. Benny! Benny! The wish bottle! Hurry! Get it off of me! Are you deadly? Yeah, tendons. Mmm, it smells yummy, vampire. It's working. Yeah. Ew, that's bad. Ain't gross. Ethan, are you okay? Anti-vampire missed anyone? Still mad at me for defending the mortals who just saved your life? Erica was right. You are no fun. Fine. You're free to go. Thank you. It's more like it. Stop! Before you go, I want Dirk's autograph. For a friend. 
Vampire awkward. Okay, you guys, your mom and I will be home from Gourmet Disco at 11. No staying up late, no scary movies. And none of that laser saber thingy, all right? <laughs> we get it. Sarah's in charge. Yep, I promise. It's all good. Yeah, all good. Huh. All right. Look, I know things are different now. And if you feel like you need to move on, well, I guess it's okay. Thanks. And I kind of like it right here. Having fun with my friends. Because I am fun, right? Yes. <laughs> yes, you are so fun. Welcome to hey, look. Entertainment it's rise. Dirk. Don't you believe me? They're real. Vampires are real. They can fly. Look, look. I have a picture of my vampire girlfriend. There, see? She's a real vampire. Sources say the struggling actor is currently receiving treatment. Poor guy. We really freaked him out. And what really freaks me out? If that mist is so out of Benny's league, who is powerful enough to conjure it up? Whoever it is, they really don't like vampires. Maybe they just haven't met the right ones yet. 